Hi, my name is Juliana Sfer and I am the SAT7 Academy Channel Manager. I've been working with SAT7 for 16 years. Hi, my name is George McKean. I'm SAT7 Arabic Programming Director. I've been with SAT7 since 2003. I've been 14 years like working with SAT7 now. According to the United Nations uh, Development Program reports, uh, the schooling system in the Arab world is very poor quality and poor qu productivity. They say that we have around 12.3 million Arab children and youth out of school, 4 million children inside Syria, around 2 million of them are out of school, and 1.4 million uh, children, Syrian children, are in the host countries. This is where the need for SAT7 Academy comes from. As we heard about the UNDP report, uh, one of the basic problems of the Arab world is the poor education. Uh, poor education that uh, causes uh, other problems like poverty, like uh, problems with democratic transition. Uh, people cannot coexist together easily if they are learning by rote or if they are learning to copy a certain example. Uh, they are not uh, flexible to accept the other. They are not flexible to fit the market, so there is lots of social and uh, ethical even problems that is related to education. So that the need for SAT7 Academy is not just a response to a certain conflict or a certain problem, while there is a need to, to, to do that, but it's wider. It's a hope and uh, uh, a vision to impact that region with a kind of uh, uh, education or a kind of uh, 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 technique that helps people to learn how to learn, how to be open to change, how you know that it's not too late to adopt a new style of thinking, or it's not too late to communicate with your kids in a better way, or it's not too late to teach your kids and uh, uh, the kids that you are responsible for as a teacher in school in a more creative way. This is a new holistic, uh, we're offering a new holistic type of education. It's not just going to school and learning numbers and learning by rote, as he just said but it's also um, affecting the heart and speaking to the attitude and the character and the behavior and changing this uh, at, at the root level, basically. Yes, of course, acquiring more knowledge and yes, of course, acquiring more uh, wider knowledge, you know, more general knowledge, but also affecting our attitudes and the hearts and the, the behavior of the people of the Middle East and uh, North Africa and the Arab world more specifically. And this is where the need is. It's not just learning. It's not just acquiring a, uh, a diploma or, uh, or a higher degree or whatever. Wh why should we need uh, a higher degree or a diploma if we don't know how to treat each other and talk to each other and resolve our conflicts? Right, and uh, what makes us excited is that we find lots of partners, lots of uh, producers who uh, uh, embraced such a vision. They, they recognized the importance of introducing that kind of new thinking to uh, uh, people, to uh, the new generations. And lots of creative people who come to answer these concerns and answer these questions with different programs and different uh, exciting genres that we hope it would be inspiring to uh, millions of our viewers. Yeah, we have like um, a new um New programs for kids, uh, very entertaining, but uh, also very much uh, useful, uh, highly educational, and sometimes enter and, you know edutainment. If you know, we can talk about edutainment, you know, uh, what else we have? Uh, we're planning to have much more programs, like uh, also about like ethic, make doing ethical business, values in in, in the workplace, values in micro enterprise, how to how to each have their own business and it's okay you can start from whatever you have, a capital or whatever, right? The purpose is like uh, these issues are important because like when education, the, the process of education uh, is dry and scary and unrelated to, uh, uh, to what is happening on the ground, it becomes something that people usually hate. It's something that is enforced on you, something to memorize and then you don't find any use for it. When it's related to things that we use in daily life, we appreciate in our life, then it makes the whole difference. Of course, of course, the backbone uh, program of uh, Foresat 7 Academy is the one and only my school. So you, you will see new series coming up. In every series, uh, we'll have like new things in it, like shorter segments, more segments, varied segments, uh, more, more that has to do with, you know, everyday life. Also education, of course, higher grades as we go. 
um, presented in a more compact way and more um, you know entertaining also and with new teachers. Lots of programs, lots of ideas, like there is lots of excitement. It's a huge challenge, but what engages us, it's part of Sat7 holistic approach that we started with since the very beginning. And what excites us that uh, we see uh, how this can impact uh, our region for a better future, how it can impact our region while it's in that critical transitional uh, time. Uh, the hopes are high that uh, we live uh, enjoying uh, that uh, kind of uh, uh, democracy, that kind of uh, acceptance one to another, that kind of people who think for themselves and can make their own choices and can uh, uh, be uh, even when they look to the situation, while it's that hard, they can look to it and say that we can change it and we can change it together. Yes, we aim to educate the mind and the heart. Mm -hmm.